everyone, welcome back to Mindful Me Mondays from Mindful Me. This week we're looking at Anti-Bullying Week and it's all about saying no to bullying. If you haven't done so already, go and download the free printable in the link in our bio. Let's get started. So let's look at the different types of bullying. Here's a crossword that you can use to help you decipher which are the four different types of bullying. So in a minute, I'm going to be talking through exactly what the types of bullying are, responding to it and how you can be supportive for a friend who may be experiencing it too. But in the meantime, before we get into that, let's look at our odd socks that we can start colouring in. So what exactly is bullying? There's three different types of bullying and one of them can be targeted. And that's where someone who feels that they are more powerful than others will target those that are lesser than them. There is also repeated bullying where continued patterns of bullying that can happen numerous times of the day. And you've also got deliberate bullying where the person is doing it on purpose to hurt or upset someone else. So how exactly should you respond to bullying? Well, there's six different ways in which you can. First, you can tell someone that you trust. Second, you can keep a record of what is happening and when it's happening. Three, do not retaliate. Four, surround yourself with people that make you feel good. Five, don't blame yourself, it is not your fault. And six, be proud of who you are and never feel that you should change who you are because of someone else. If you know of someone who's been bullied, you can do so much to help, even if you don't feel like stepping in. Don't get involved in harassment, teasing or spreading gossip about others off or online. Don't watch and encourage the bullying, just walk away. Don't forward or respond to offensive or upsetting messages or photos. Support the person who's been bullied to ask for help. For example, you could go with them to a place where they can get help or provide them with information about where to go to for help. And lastly, tell a trusted adult that may be able to help you. If you want some more information about bullying and how you can best support other people with their bullying, then head over to the link in our bio where you can get some more information.
now we've finished with our odd socks, let's finish up with a personal story about how bullying has impacted you or someone you know by using Mr Sock. We really hope you've enjoyed learning all about bullying in this week's free printable. Don't forget to click the link in our bio if you want to learn a little bit more about it. But in the meantime, we will see you next week.